please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Hello and welcome. HGTV here. I'm your boy, Richie Rich, and here is Chris. Stay tuned for your latest news, weather, and sports. But first, to Nick with the weather. Thanks. When you came in today, it was 6 degrees outside. Around lunchtime, the temperature will have gone all the way up to the low 20s, with minor winds, and it will be staying that way throughout the rest of the day. Make sure to be careful on the roads today, as they are still very slippery from the snow over the weekend. Tomorrow morning, when you come in, the temperature will be a much warmer 25 degrees. That's it for weather. Now back to Chris and Richard. Thanks, Nick. Today on lines 1 and 2, we have chicken nuggets. Line 3, we have soup and salad bar featuring potato soup. Line 4 is ravioli and assorted stuffed crust pizza. But line 5 is closed. A happy birthday today goes out to Christian Matias and Paulina Ramos Garcia. Sending out of sports with Izzy. Welcome back, big dogs. In sports action from over the weekend, all sports were postponed over the weekend due to the weather. The wrestling and swimming teams will be going to conference this Saturday. In bowling news, the bowling team traveled to Lebanon this Saturday for the team sectional play. At the end of the day, the girls became the Wabash Valley sectional champs. On Sunday, the girls traveled to Crawfordsville for individual play, and with Jordan Anderson qualifying for the advanced regional tournament, both the team regional and individual regional will be held in Bloomington Saturday, January 19th at 9 a.m. And there will be a softball call-out meeting on Wednesday, January 16th after school in room 305. Please uh, plan to be there if you're interested in playing softball this year. And another news, interested in joining track this spring? There will be a track and field meeting tomorrow after school in the Upper Case Arena bleachers. The meeting will be at 2.50. It should really not interfere with uh, winter sports practices, so please attend this meeting if interested. See Coach Galati if you have any questions. And in NFL news, the Colts played the Chiefs Saturday and defeated the Chiefs 31-13. Is that right? Oh, sorry. I read that wrong. I mean, the Colts got beat by a lot. Well, that's all for sports. Now back to the studio. Those thoroughly washed dishes, Izzy. If you are interested in attending the Hoosier Boy State or the Hoosier Girl State, please pick up an application in Student Services. Applications are due January 16th, this Wednesday. Seniors, if you have not ordered your cap and gown, the deadline is March 1st and the cost is $52.43. Please stop by the main office and talk to Ms. Rennick if you have any questions. She will need your height and weight along with a $10 deposit to be able to place your order. There's an academic call out this Wednesday in 2.55 in room 221. There's also a mandatory student ambassadors meeting in room 205 during community this Wednesday also. Interested in free schooling? Here's a word from a college connection coach. Welcome back, big dogs. In sports, I Good morning, hot dogs. I'm Ms. Scanley, a college connection coach, and today I'm talking about something very exciting, the Frankfurt Promise. Last week, our mayor, Chris McBarnes, came together with Ivy Tech to decide that any Frankfurt High School graduate is going to receive free education through Ivy Tech. Now, either at our Frankfurt campus or our Lafayette campus, after you apply, if your scholarships and your financial aid do not cover the cost of tuition of your classes, the city of Frankfurt is going to come in and pay the rest. That means if you want to get a certificate, if you want to go into mechanics, welding, something like that, or get a two-year degree in associates, it's going to be completely covered by the city. It's a great opportunity, hot dogs. And remember, just because you apply to Ivy Tech doesn't mean you're necessarily committed. You can apply, see what some other schools might be offering you, and if you decide free college is the better way to go, you've got that available. If you have any questions, stop by my table on Mondays or Fridays. Have a good day, hot dogs. Due to the snowstorm on Saturday, the DECA district competition will be canceled and will not be rescheduled. Students are asked to see Ms. Bishop to see whether they qualified based on their student or their excuse me their event exam sto scores. Students who are planning on taking a paper to state need to see Ms. Bishop ASAP. State conference information is available now. Thanks for tuning in. It's been HGTV. Nice having you. Be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already. And as always, we'll see you later. Yeah. <laughs>